the moment they've all been waiting for. Blast the music because the Baylor softball squad is going dancing. After falling to, the, to Iowa State in the Big 12 tournament, the Bears came back to Waco with one mindset. Hear their name called during Selection Sunday. And well, they did. It was a night full of nerves and emotions as the Bears waited to hear if and where they would be playing in the NCAA tournament. The Bears secured their 15 national tournament bid with an at-large and head to the Salt Lake City Regional where they face Ole Miss in the first round of play. After failing to hear their name called last year, head coach Glenn Moore says it's the moment this team has been waiting for all season. You know, they made a commitment last year not to not to be in that same position this year and uh, the price they paid in the off season and in the fall working up to this point is very rewarding as a coach to see that pay off. It doesn't always pay off. You can say the right things and and have the right intentions, but to actually put feet to your uh, words and, and do it over the off season and, and deal with the adverse situations that we've had to deal with, with injuries and things like that, uh, you know, it says a lot about the character of this team, and I think we were rewarded today for that. Even though hopes of hosting the first round of play were shattered, it didn't matter because this team had one goal. Mackenzie Wilson remembers that feeling from last season, and one year later, that commitment became a reality. Everyone felt sick to their stomach, like that this is not where Baylor's supposed to be. This is not the standard that Baylor softball upholds. Um, and so in that room, uh, yeah, a commitment was made that we weren't going to be in this position uh, again and that um, we were going to do everything and anything in our power um, to flip the script. The Bears will open the double elimination tournament against the Rebels with first pitch Friday at 12 p.m. Central.